Hey, I'm Dr. Ray Drury, and today we're talking about occipital neuralgia. Now, what exactly is occipital neuralgia? Well, it is nerve pain at the level of the occiput. Now, where is the occiput? The occiput is right the very base of your head, the very base of your skull, uh, and it's uh, the bottom part that sits on top of the neck and the upper two bones in the neck. Now, what are the symptoms of occipital neuralgia? Well, oftentimes it's typically just pain, severe pain at the base of the head. Sometimes it'll radiate up into the head and the skull. Sometimes it can create severe headaches. Uh, it can affect how you sleep. It can affect your energy. It can affect how you concentrate. It can affect your whole life uh, if it's a, a chronic condition. Now, um, where does occipital neuralgia come from? Well, uh, it comes from something at the top of the neck, something being out of the line. Now, typical uh, medical approach, they primarily have two weapons, drugs and surgery, uh, and neither are really very effective when it comes to occipital neuralgia. Obviously, there's no surgery. Uh, sometimes they have actually gone so far as, as uh, uh, cut the occipital nerve, um, and uh, uh, which is not a should be last resort, obviously. Anytime you do it, something, some cut something, you can't uncut it. Um, and then the medications oftentimes uh, not only just affect this area, but affects your whole body, right? I mean, they're usually pretty powerful drugs that uh, make it hard to work and drive and, and even stay awake at times. So uh, where occipital neuralgia actually comes from is there's pressure placed at the top of the neck on that occipital nerve. It is called the occipital nerve that comes out from underneath the base of your skull comes off of the brain stem and goes up and innervates the head. Now, what happens is if one of the bones at the top of the neck get even a little bit out of alignment, it can actually put pressure on that nerve. Now, this is what happens. If they go and they look at your head, they look at the base of your skull, there's nothing wrong, nothing wrong at all with your head. But somehow or another, you have pain here. And what happens is, is the message gets altered. The normal message that should say, hey, everything's okay, brain, tells the brain, hey, everything's okay, there's no pain, there's no numbness, there's no tingling, there's no headache, uh, everything's okay. Well, that message normally would get to the brain and everything would be great. But if one of these bones is out of the line, it changes the message before it gets to the brain, it's signaling the brain that something's wrong. When that happens, the brain interprets pain. So you get you are experiencing pain when there is no pain there because the bone at the top of the neck is out of a line and it's creating that sensation to the brain. So the only way to remove the sensation is to take the pressure off of the brain stem where it innervates with the occipital nerve. Then normal message that says, hey, brain, everything's okay, gets unimpeded all the way to the brain and everything comes out fine. So if you have occipital neuralgia, do yourself a favor, find an upper cervical doctor near you. If you're not in the Charlotte area, Google upper cervical chiropractor. If you're in the Charlotte area, give our office a call. We're the office for you. We never charge for the initial consultation to see if you have a problem up here or not. If you do, then we'll explain to you what we need to do to fix it. If you don't, then we'll try to find another doctor near you or that, that has a special, another specialist to help you with your occipital neuralgia. So if you live in the Charlotte area, Matthews, Pineville, Rock Hill, Fort Mill, South Carolina, Huntersville, Mortersville, anywhere Lake Norman, Lake Wiley area, give our office a call, 704-588-5560. Let's see, let's get to the cause of your occipital neuralgia. Let's get the problem corrected once and for all so we no longer have to chase these symptoms. We look forward to meeting you. I hope you have a great day.